Hi guys, it's Joan here. Welcome back. Today I am wearing my very comfy clothes um, just at home in my sweater. No makeup on, just a little bit of lip balm. But I wanted to do a quick video for you guys. Hopefully it'll be quick. Um, and it'll be a what's in my purse video today. I hope you guys enjoy it. This is my first what's in my purse video. So um, keep watching. So the purse that I have been wearing a lot these days is this one right here. It's from Cotton On. And I like it because it's supposed to be um, like a satchel. Um, it has a handle right here and then it has a long thing that you could um, toss over your shoulder. And this is what I've been using um, for every day for work, for everything. Like I said, it's from Cotton On, and it was about 30 something, I think, dollars, maybe $40 with tax. And they also had a black one. I'm not sure if they have it anymore, because when I bought it, it was the last one from the store. But to start with, I will show you my wallet. Um, it's a Mark by Mark Jacobs wallet, and it's like this lilac lavender color which I love because um, purple is my favorite color and it's kind of blinding you but I was gifted this about two years ago from my girlfriends and I love it it just you know has money in it <laughs> next I have my sunglasses and these are my Ray-Bans this one I was gifted for my birthday as well. And I will show you what they look like on. Looks pretty good, I hope. Um, to tell you guys the model number, it says RB3293. So I hope that's um, the model number that I'm reciting for you guys. And then I have um, this, which is my favorite facial spray. If you are curious, I do have a video reviewing a bunch of facial mists. And this one is specifically from The Body Shop and it's the Vitamin E. It does have a label, but mine got all nasty so I just peeled it off. But especially during the winter, I always have this in my purse because my skin's really dry and as soon as I spray it on, it leaves a great um, moisturized, hydrated finish. And then I have my favorite hand cream. This one is from Skin Food. And it is called the Sugar Hand Cream. If you can see that. And Skin Food, I know they have it in some places like S Singapore. They did just bring it to um, California. It looks like an ointment type. And as you can see, it has a slight sheen, but it dries down really fast. And this is my favorite, absolute favorite um, cream that I use, um, especially during the winter, because I have really dry hands. I'm washing it constantly at work. Um, but I know that if you live in the Los Angeles area, I know that South Coast Plaza, or no, 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 not South Coast Plus, Irvine Spectrum, as well as I think Cerritos, um, the Cerritos Town Center or Cerritos Mall has skin food now, but I don't think they carry this item. I don't know why, it's my favorite, but when I went there to look for it, they did not have it. So anyways, this is getting to be long, longer than I expected, but this is my favorite hand cream. And I've been keeping this in my purse, which is the Maybelline Dream Matte Powder. And my shade is in sand, medium. And I just carry this in my purse. Um, when I'm at work, my skin gets a little bit um, oily in the T-zone. I'll just kind of um, freshen up. And then I also have my mints, which these are my absolute favorite mints. It's the only, I don't chew gum. Um, and these are the only mints I buy over and over again. It's the small ones. They're really tiny if you look at them. They're really, really tiny. Oh, oopsie. But they're so potent, it's crazy. <laughs> Every time my friends eat these, they're like, they're so small, why are they so powerful? Anyways, what else? Oh, I have my um, Hello Kitty mirror, which is gonna reflect right now. 
And this is just from Sephora and it has um, two magnifications on it. I carry that in my purse to check myself out, of course. And then I have um, my headphones, which I use for work because I don't want to bother other people with my music because I'm always listening to music during work. Um, then sometimes I have my camera, which today I do. It's just this Canon. Right now I'm filming with my laptop, with my MacBook EyeSight. I happen to have some um, allergy medicine in there today, Claritin. My allergies have been going crazy because of the weather change. And for some more interesting stuff, I do have a couple lipsticks and <laughs> lip balms. This is how crazy I am with lip products. But to start with, I have my Wonder Woman um, lipstick. And this is in Marquise D or Marquis D. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. And I don't think it's going to be able to read on the camera. But it's this gorgeous color. I consider this um, one of those My Lips But Better colors. Um, I think it's a good choice. That, similar to the other lipstick that I had in my purchase, which is the Chanel Rouge Coco Shine in Boy. And I will actually compare those two because I think they're both a My Lip But Better type of lip color. And those are the two that I have. Um, Marquise D and Boy from Chanel. And then I have two lip balms. One is the Laura Mercier Lip Silk, which I love and I'm almost out of. I've been using this mainly. And then when I was at Sephora, I picked this up with my 100 Beauty Insider points. And it's the Jack Black Lip Balm in Black Tea and Blackberry. Um, I like it, but I feel like the, um, the Octinoxate, the Sunblock, the SPF in this lip balm is making my lips peel. But as far as the smell goes, it just smells like, like raspberries or blackberries. And I have that in there. And I have my Travelo, of course. Right now it's filled with a Chloe perfume, but I haven't been using this because I've just been spritzing my Dior Addict to Life perfume just on in the morning. But, yeah... I want to get a new Travelo to fill it up with the Dior perfume that I'm using. But this Travelo is so beat up and scratched up and everything, but it's still there. It's still working. Um, I also have this little, it's, it says Giorgio Armani, but it's actually just a sample jar that they had given me um, foundation sample. And I just filled it up with some, what was it, Cetaphil? Um, moisturizer because of the dry winter. My skin is killing. Oh, I had another lip product in here. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. This is the um, Revlon Lip Butter, which I'm sure you guys have seen by now. And this is in the color Creme Brulee. So I had three lipsticks in there, which I did not even know. And then, of course, I always carry around a hair band. I mean, um, yeah, hairband. No, no, no. A hair tie. <laughs> Sorry about that. And then I have um, just a sample of some concealer that I was trying out. I think this is from Makeup Forever, the full coverage, which I don't really like. And I have, I always carry around one of these pens. Um, some of my, some of you that has been shopping in like Asian places might know this. It's this one is Japanese. I know Korean places have it too. Oh no, this is a Korean one. But Japanese brands have them too. It's double-sided. It's one side is like a thicker marker. And then the other side is more of a thin marker, but works as a pen. And of course, it's in a purple color, which is my favorite. I always carry this around in my um, purse because I'm always writing post-its. <laughs> I don't want you to see what I have, but I'm writing post-its to myself. And even when I go grocery shopping, this is the perfect market to cross things off because it's really thick, if you guys care to know that. Um, and then I just have my my keys, my house keys, and then my work thingy. And um, what is this? 
the cutest little flash drive I got from Korea. It's four gigs on this tiny thing. And then of course my Hello Kitty keychain, which I absolutely love. It's so cute, I've had it forever. And then last but not least, oh no, no, this is, I have two more things left. I have um, these wipes from work. I'm always um, sanitizing my cell phone and my keyboard because, you know, it's gonna have so many germs on it. And the last thing, I promise, is my Bluetooth, which I just got. These are my favorite Bluetooth. They're from Motorola. And the reason why they're my favorite is because it has this flip thing, which is called a boom. And this boom, it basically turns on and off the Bluetooth headset. And I love it because it's easy to use. It connects to your phone quickly. And it works really fine with my iPhone. I bought another one from Motorola that was supposed to be a fancier, more expensive version of this. And it didn't work out. So I ended up buying this one. But um, yeah, that was uh, what's in my purse. I know this turned out to be longer than I expected because I started talking and reviewing my lipsticks and whatever. But um, I hope you guys enjoy that. And hopefully in my next video, I will look better for you with makeup on and everything. But until then, um, thank you for watching. As always, please comment and please subscribe. And also, please follow me on Twitter. It's to be glam, the same as my username on YouTube. And I will see you next time. Bye.